morning. Um, glad to have had this opportunity. Amen. Uh, Amen. I got asked by Deacon, of course, to uh, come for a given message. So I'm going to do my best to live up. Glory to God. Yes. All right. Praise God, brother. All right, brother. Uh, let's say a prayer real quick. Lord, we thank you for this time, yes, this opportunity yes, you've yes, given us. Yes, Lord. To come in your presence to hear something that you have wanted us to learn. Yes, yes. Um, that's something we said and done to not only yes, leave lost yes. souls, but our souls back to you. Yes, yes. yes. In Jesus' name we pray and ask it all. Father, yes. Father, Amen. 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 If you would turn to Romans chapter 8. Romans. And we're going to start at verse 31. Mm -hmm. Romans chapter 8. Yes, sir. Starting at verse 31. If you have it, say amen. 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 Uh, starting at verse 31, I'm reading from the, I believe, the New King James Version. It says, What then shall we say to these things? Uh, if God is for us, who can be against yes. us? Yes. He who did not spare his own son, but delivered him up, for us all. Uh -huh. How shall he not with him also freely give us all things? Oh, wow. Who shall bring a charge against us? Hmm. Who shall bring a charge against God's elect? It is God who justifies. Yeah. Who is he who condemns? It is Christ who died mm. and furthermore is also risen who is even at the right hand of God which also makes intercession for us. Yes, he does. 35 says, who shall separate us from the love of God, the love of Christ? So tribulation, no. or distress, no. or persecution, or famine, yeah. or nakedness, or peril, or sword. As it is written, for your sake we are killed all the day long. We are counted as sheep for the slaughter. Yet in all these yes, things, all uh, these things. We are more than conquerors Woo! through him who loved us. Yeah. Thank you, 38. For I am persuaded yes. Yes. that neither death, neither death nor life, say that, say that, nor angels, nor principalities, nor powers, say it, say it. nor things present, nor things to come, yes. nor height, nor depth, nor any other creative thing shall be able to separate us from the love of God which is in Christ Jesus our Lord. Hallelujah. 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 Deacon Richardson started this series of messages of the new CTC. News. Say that. CTC 21. Mm -hmm. Connecting with others. Glory. Transforming lives. Conquering in Christ. His first message. Uh, connecting with others. Let's connect and stay connected. Uh -huh. Where he spoke on not only seeing the importance of establishing connection with God through a through his son, Jesus Christ, uh -huh. but also staying connected and abiding in the spirit. All right. All right. All right. Next, we have transforming lives, same body, new me. New All me. right. Explain, explain mm -hmm. that. Mm -hmm. Go same ahead. body, uh -huh. new me. In this message, she spoke about understanding that giving your life to Christ is only the beginning. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. And as you go through this life, there should be a difference in how you walk, mm -hmm. how you talk, well, and how you live this new life in Christ. Uh -huh. Now, today I'm going to try to give you the last seed the way I know how to get it. All right, now. <laughs> Today's message conquering in Christ the benefits of being called. All right, now. Benefits of being called. In the first seven chapters of Romans, uh -huh. the Apostle Paul lays out the blueprint to help us explain what these things in chapter 31 that he's speaking about. All right, now. Okay. So we have chapters 1 to 3. He talks about us being under the judgment of God. Uh -huh. And that we stand in great need. Chapter 4, by faith alone, this righteousness is received. Uh -huh. And chapter 5, we have been reconciled to God. Uh -huh. And chapter 6 and 7, we have been indwelt by the Spirit of God. Uh -huh. And at the beginning of chapter 8, uh -huh. we have been adopted by God. Adopted. Then, the, then you get to chapter 8, verse 31. We have, what shall we say to these things? Amen. If God is for us, who can be against us? With that being said, I'm going to try and give you what I believe 
are the three benefits we get once we have accepted his son as our savior. Mm -hmm. These three big benefits. Big benefits. The big three. Big three. No opposition. No condemnation. Uh -oh. No separation. All right. All right now. Listen, listen. Okay. Starting at verse 31, it says, What shall we say to these things? If God is for us, who could be against us? Mm -hmm. Now, being the jokester that I am, I said I was going to say this verse. What should we say to these things? If God is for us, who could be against us? And I was going to say, let us stand. Uh, for, for me, that's enough. Uh, that's enough. That's enough. If God is for me, who could be against me? I can go home with that. That's right. I can, I can go home. Okay? No. However, God in his infinite wisdom, uh -huh. he not only said God is yeah. for you, he wanted to show you as well. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. So we get to verse 32. Uh -huh. yes. Verse 32. He who did not spare his own son, oh, say yes. listen now. but deliver him up for us all, mm -hmm. how should we not, awesome. how shall he not also with him mm -hmm. freely give us all things? All right, mm -hmm. The right. ultimate sign, the ultimate gift that anyone could give Yes. He gave his son. Yes, yes, he did. Yes, he did. You can't tell me God doesn't love me <laughs> because he gave his only son. Oh, yeah. glory, glory, glory. Two thousand years down the line, he saw me needing a savior. Yeah. yeah. So he gave his son. Right. What shall bring a charge? Next, he says, "What should be the charge against God's elect? Yeah. Mm -hmm. It is God who justifies." Yes. Yeah. Once you are given your life to Christ, once you have given your life to Christ. And you believe in his son, that God has spared his own son, not that he spared his own son, there is no charge against you. Mm. No one can say you did it. Yeah. No one can leave you there, yes. leave you in the box. Yes. You have it. You have, you have it. a ticket. Mm. You have a ticket that was sent by the Father, mm. purchased by the Son, uh -huh. and confirmed by the Spirit. Yes. Yes. All right. All right. All right. All right. Yes. Second, we have no condemnation. Yes. Verse 34 says, yes, yes, yes. Who is he who condemns? It is Christ who died. Mm -hmm. And furthermore, is also risen. Yes. Mm -hmm. uh, glory, glory. Who is even at the right hand of God, mm -hmm. who is also making intercession for us. Yes. Mm -hmm. Now, when you look at the definition of condemnation, yes. you will see one of his definitions is to pronounce to be guilty, mm -hmm. sentenced to punishment, yes, yes. or to pass judgment. Mm -hmm. Sounds just like the devil. <laughs> the devil will keep you in what you are, in the place that you are. Yeah. He will bring up things that you things that happen, mistakes you've made, yes. just so that you don't go to Christ. Yes. Just so that you don't see how much God loves you. Yes, yes. yes. He will try to get you to believe that God doesn't care about you mm -hmm. and will not forgive you. Mm -hmm. But we have to remind ourselves and the devil. Hmm. That Jesus died for our sins. Yes, he yes. did. Yes, he did. He paid the penalty. Yes, yeah. he did. This is why we sing. Say there are several, several songs, yeah. and several songs in His yeah. fullness. Several songs right, that brother. we sing that that allow us to understand this part. My yeah. sin, oh the bliss of oh, the glorious star. My yeah. sin, not in part, but the whole. Oh, was yeah. Yeah. And I bear the Lord. Praise yeah. the Lord. Praise the Lord. Yeah. Praise the Lord. Oh my soul. Yeah. 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 Lastly, we have no separation. My, my, my. Reading the last couple of verses of this chapter in Romans, uh -huh. it feels like Paul spends twice as much time on the fact mm. that nothing can separate us from the love of Christ. Wow. Yes. He begins to run down the different struggles in life that we may go through. Mm. That is a strong enough to keep us from his love. Uh -huh. He starts at verse 35. Mm -hmm. Who shall separate us? Who shall? From yes. the love of Christ. Yes. All right now. Shall tribulation. No. As we know, there's various troubles in life. Uh, yeah. Or distress. Mm -hmm. All right now. The pressures of life. Mm -hmm. Or persecution. Or famine. Or nakedness. Or peril of sword. Uh -huh. and as, writ as it is written, for your sake, we are killed all day long. Yes. That, for me, Paul is speaking from experience. Yes. Yes. We know for a fact Paul went through persecution. He went through, yeah. he went through distress. He went he, Everything but possibly the soul, we know Paul is speaking from the spirit. Yes, yes, yes. Uh -huh. It's all right, brother. Amen. Um, my, my, my. A pearl of sword. As it is written, for your sake we are killed all the day long. Yet in all these things, we are more than conquerors yes. through him who has loved us. Yes. This explains Romans 8.28. And we know that all things oh. work together. Yes. Oh. Yes. For the good of those who love God. 
-hmm. to those who are called according to his purpose. Yeah. There is nothing I can go through mm -hmm. in this life where God isn't with me. Yes. Wow. Amen. He Amen. will use everything I go through mm -hmm. so that I can understand that I am more than a conqueror. More than. He didn't leave it there. He goes on to verse 38. Mm -hmm. Now he's speaking from the heart. Hey, I'm a witness. I've been through these things. Oh, yeah. right. Verse 38. I am persuaded yeah. that neither death nor life. Uh, what I'm going through now on this side of glory yeah. or the next. Yeah. I'm persuaded neither death nor life. Mm. Nor angels, nor principalities, nor powers. Nothing, no, nothing in the spiritual realm. All right. Nor things present or things to come. Mm. Not what I've been through, huh. not what I'm going through right now, yes. not what I may go through in the future. Yes. 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 Nor height, nor depth. We know that based off of Psalms 139 and 8. Uh -huh. If I make, if I go up to the heavens, you are there. Yes. Right. Yes. If I make my bed in heaven, yes. you are there. Yes. Yes. There's nowhere you can go that yes. you can yes. be separated yes. from him. Yes. Yes. Our powers, nor things present or things to come, nor yes. height, nor depth, nor any created thing shall yes. separate us mm -hmm. from the love of God who is in Christ Jesus oh. our Lord. No opposition. Yes. No condemnation. Mm -hmm. None. No separation. Yeah. Amen. amen and amen. 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 amen.